You know, some people live really interesting lives. Let's take the case of Victoria Benton Frank. She's one of those people. She was raised in New York City. She now lives in beautiful Charleston, South Carolina. And um, she studied at the French Culinary Institute, was a chef in New York City for years. She's currently married to a man who's a chef. She gave up cooking because she was in basement kitchens while her friends were all out having a good time. And if you get to know Victoria, she has a very big personality, as does her mother, whose name you might know, Dorothea Benton Frank. If you're big readers, you might know that her mom wrote 20 different novels and then started telling her daughter, you can do this. You should be writing novels. And her daughter, Victoria, has always, has always been a performer. She was an actress uh, for a while, in addition to um, being a performance artist in the kitchen. And uh, she finally started to do that. Her mom took a look at some of her writing, approved of it, got, got Victoria's stamp of approval, or rather Dorothea's stamp of approval. And, um, and again, she had written 20 novels and was uh, uh, well received. Her writing was very well received out there in the market. Unfortunately, Dorothea died at the young age of just 67 before Victoria had an opportunity to finish her novel, which is now out. It's called My Magnolia Summer. And uh, her story is a terrific one. And uh, like I said, she's got a big personality. You can hear all about it on episode number 128 of the Novelist Spotlight podcast. I interview uh, Victoria for a, an hour. We hope to see you there again, episode number 128 of the Novelist Spotlight podcast.